of Big Two Sports with Sports Director Ben Peck. We start on the junior college level, New Mexico, the Lady T-Birds, springing perhaps the largest upset of the national tournament yesterday, taking down the previously undefeated number one overall seed, Wabash Valley, out of Aurora, Illinois. Shout out to Aurora. Lady T-Birds, though, they're the ones competing in the final four. And toward the end of the first quarter, Amaya Lewis transition crossover bucket, and the T-Birds go up nine to seven. Here's Hutch on the inbounds, though, with the counter, Kelsey Brett. She played wonderful for the Dragons. They take a 10-9 lead, and then Brett doing it on defense. Takes the charge, no ma'am, no basket, and then capitalizing with this chance here. Brett, pull up, Jay, yes ma'am. All of a sudden, Hutch with a three-point lead on the other end, though. Can't really see her, but Tamiris Andrade, trust me, she made that three-point shot. We had a 22-22 tie at the half, but New Mexico able to take it 60-54. Aaron Reynolds with more from Lubbock. Well, folks, for the first time in program history, New Mexico Junior College is headed to the national championship. The number eight Lady Thunderbirds have been piling on the upsets throughout this tournament, and they added another one tonight. New Mexico was able to edge out Hutchinson tonight to advance to the final game. This game was tied at 22 going into the second half, but the Thunderbirds grabbed the lead and hung on to it into the second part of the game. The game changer for New Mexico, getting the ball inside. The Thunderbirds struggled to get the ball inside in the first half and give Hutchinson its credit. The Dragons denied that look well in the first half and then their health defense did a great job to make those shots difficult whenever New Mexico did get the ball inside. Head coach Drew Sanders says getting their posts more touches made a world of difference. On offense we were rushing everything and we got the kids to move the ball more, share the ball more and we got them to get it inside and uh, you know and that helped immensely. Then we started blocking out on defense and we're giving them second chance points. It's a quick turnaround now for New Mexico. The championship game is tomorrow at 11 a.m. So we will see if the Thunderbirds can cut down the nets for the first time in program history. Reporting at the NJCAA National Championship in Lubbock, I'm Aaron Reynolds, Big Two Sports.